Hey, what is going on, kings and queens? You, uh, you know who it is, right? Right? Royal Gilly here from Team Royal Gaming. In the background of this beautiful, fantastic video, I have some Call of Duty Black Ops gameplay, and this game has been a lot of fun. I've really been enjoying it and playing the fuck out of it. Uh, but anyways, the inspiration for this video is from this guy. So, Amar wants me to talk about getting in trouble with girls. You know what this calls for? You know what this calls for? Another story time with Gilly. And I'm gonna be talking about, uh, some hickey issues. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna talk about, you know, you'll, you'll find out, okay? But before I get into this story, I'd like to please beg and ask for you. Uh, to leave a quick little like. Go ahead and jizz on the like button down below. That'd really help me out and I'd appreciate it. So, uh, anyways, let me tell you about the time I got in trouble, uh, with some hickeys. And if you don't know what a hickey is, I'll go ahead and throw a picture up for you. But it's basically, they're kind of these really terrible things, right? It's what happens when somebody sucks on your skin and it kind of, like, leaves, like, a bruise. Like, it looks like, it, they look really nasty, like you got the fuck beat out of you, you know? Uh, but they're cool like they're not cool, you know, but I think that uh, they're they're really fun to uh, To give and to not I don't want hickeys on me honestly, but uh, I don't know It kind of feels good when you receive it, you know having some chick suck on your neck and you know It's a it's a weird kind of thing, but it has its short-term benefits and its long-term detriments Okay, so about uh, almost a year ago, okay, I was a fucking 15 year old boy dating a girl and uh, I was in a pool with her, right? And we were alone in this pool, swimming around and whatnot, but you know, I don't know how it got to this point, but we were in this situation, in this position where I was kind of like holding her and it was, oh man, it was nice. I don't want to get all hot and heavy on you, but it was really cool because she was like all up against me and she had like her legs wrapped around my waist and I was kind of like carrying her in the pool and uh, I, I don't remember exactly but the conversation we were like hey should we give each other hickeys you know I, it was kind of like almost a competition thing like you know who can give each other the the best hickey right and so I went you know I put my lips on her neck and I like you know oh my god man it was really really incredible because like we have our bodies up against each other touching and it was cool, okay, but you know, I start sucking on her neck and I straight suck on this thing as hard as I can. Just, you know, I don't really know how to explain it, you know, but just suck, suck, suck for a good amount of time, right? And then uh, I did that. I did it, right? I sucked on this chick's neck and, uh, you know, I, 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 you know, I stopped sucking. I, just, you know, take my head back and I look at it and I'm like, shit, that's really noticeable. That is a really fat old fucking hickey right on your neck. Okay, and uh, I remember she tried to give me one, but I don't. Re I don't think she did. I don't really remember how that worked out. Uh, but I didn't really have one, and she had this big old fat one, right? <laughs> and anyways, you know, we uh, we swim around and shit. You know, that's that's whatever. Okay. Uh, later, we end up going to the mall, and I'm walking around with this girl. And she has a big fat old hickey on her neck, and I'm like, you know what, we should probably do something about this. So, uh, I went and we spent like the, like, we didn't have that much money, but we spent like the last money we had on some concealer, which is like this makeup shit. So I had to go in with her to this makeup shop, and we bought some concealer, and it was like 20 fucking bucks for this tiny little tube, I was all pissed off. But it was necessary, because, uh, we had to cover this up. And, you know, we go, we buy it, and we didn't put it on right away. And we ran into my mom. My mom was at this mall, too. Uh, I don't know, you know, just shopping and stuff. And my mom, like, notices it right away. And my mom had my back. My mom's a gangster, right? She's all, you know, because her first initial reaction, you know, she really likes me. She doesn't think that I did this. She doesn't think that her innocent little son would put this fat old hickey on this girl's neck. So... She's like, who did that to you? And she thought she was, you know, my mom thought my girlfriend was cheating on me. So she, you know, she was about to, you know, she had my back. It was really cool. Thanks, mom. But uh, I was like, no, mom, I did this. And uh, we bought concealer. And she's like, you better put that on. Because if her dad sees that, he's going to kick your ass. And anyways, let's fast forward. Three days later, 
Uh, we went out to breakfast. Me, my girlfriend, my mom, my brother, and my girlfriend's parents, right? So we were sitting there at breakfast, and I had met up with this girl every day up to then, and she had always covered it up really good with concealer and made sure that nobody noticed it. Her, she, I asked her, I was like, did your parents see it? And she's like, nope. But we're sitting there at breakfast, and I look over at her neck, and I'm like, damn, did you put concealer on? She's like, no, I ran out. And, like, I, I whispered this to her, right? And I'm like, shit, that's really noticeable. And, you know, it was three days later, so it was kind of going away. But I'm like, you know, I was, like, really scared because her dad is sitting across the table, and I'm like, he is going to see this. He's going to notice it, and there's going to be this big scene. He's going to kick my ass. He's going to yell at my mom. I don't know. I was pretty scared about it, right? And we're eating breakfast, and... Uh, towards the end of the meal, I'm looking at him, and he is just straight staring the fuck down. Like, he's staring right at uh, this this girl that I was dating, and he's looking at her neck, and he's, like, talking to his wife. And I'm like, shit. You know, they obviously know. And um, to wrap this up, he didn't, like, say anything at breakfast, but after we were done with the breakfast, I got grounded. She got grounded for, like, a month. Like, I got in trouble a lot. We both got in trouble a lot, you know, shit taken away. And, uh, you know, I'm just glad that I didn't get my ass kicked, but we both got in a lot of trouble. And, uh, from then on out, our parents were like super concerned that we were going to like fuck each other and stuff. So they were all super strict. Um, but yeah, that's what happened. I got in trouble with hickeys and it was, it was a good experience, but, uh, you know, you got to be careful with hickeys. Just make out instead. Don't leave noticeable marks on each other, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you next time. I love you, kings and queens. Goodbye! Hi, my name is... Hi, my name is... Hi, my name is... It's Royal Gilly! Hi, my name is... Hi, my name is... Hi, my name is... It's Royal Gilly! Hi, my name is... Hi, my Excuse name me! Is, hi, my name is... It's Royal Gilly!